And what are we going to make in Ellen Dean's kitchen today? Well, I thought we'd make an Eve's pudding. We had a lot of apples on our apple tree this year. We had over a hundred and we thought we'd put them to good use and make an Eve's pudding. Uh, first of all, I've prepared it earlier, you know, actually, the ingredients. We've got a hundred butter, margarine. <laughs> what have we got a hundred? We've got a hundred grams of butter. We've got a hundred grams of sugar <laughs> and we have a hundred grams of flour. Now, what sort of sugar is it? Uh, castor. Right. Yeah. And what sort of flour is it? Self-raising. You got it. Yeah. <laughs> and two eggs. Um, free thought, range. Free range eggs, of Absolutely. course. Absolutely. And I thought, right, okay, we'll make this eggs pudding. The apples are already stewed, so I will crack on. We should call it Ellen's pudding, really. Ellen. Um, and then if anybody. Ellen's Eve's pudding. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just telling Ellen. Forget it. Just let's get cracking with this eggs pudding. Oh, let me just tell you. Made some bread earlier. Look at this. And can we just say that again, please? The bread. Right. There we go. Look at wow. that. Wow. You made that. Bread. No. Can you, I was going to say, can you say <laughs> that without kidding, laughing, only please? Kidding. Um, but that could be next on the list. And this jam is—I can't see because I haven't got my glasses on. But it's um, Winnie's Yorkshire Delights. Beautiful jam made in Yorkshire, and uh, handmade, of course. And it's apricot, which is one of my favourites. I can recommend that apricot jam. It's delicious. Winners. Wins. Right. Wins. 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 Apricot jam. Yes, I told you. I, I didn't have my glasses on. I think you'll find Win on Facebook, actually. Right. Mm. Oh. Do you know what I've just spotted? What? Some of the apples. Hang on a sec. Oh, here. Yeah. Look at the size of these apples off our apple tree. Marvellous. Over a hundred we had of those, so we might be making more Eve's pudding and more apple crumble and more apple pies than you can shake a stick at. Do you think we can freeze them? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> I'll have to do something with them, keep. Right, here we go. So, first of all, I'm going to um, use my little trusty uh, mixer and mix the butter, margarine. No, it's butter. Butter. Unsalted. It's unsalted butter, butter. of course it is, I knew that. <laughs> Nice and creamy. Now, um, I think we'll add a bit of egg, shall we? Right, I'll put a bit of that in. Just a bit, just a, bit a tablespoon. And again, a bit more mix. Um, I would say that was flour, wouldn't you? No, oh, sugar. I think I'll add some flour now. I think it's time to add the flour. Otherwise, it will be soup. Fold it. Fold it? Fold it in. Fold it. Fold it in the spoon. Right. Cross your fingers. <laughs> all of the cooks out there that's watching this will be saying what on earth is she doing Especially can't you imagine why can you so, rosemary will be laughing her socks off now the thing is it always comes out nice it'll be fine so no matter how i do it it comes out really really tasty that's how muffins were invented <laughs> sorry that's how muffins were invented somebody must have slipped and tossed everything in together and it have. worked <laughs> I was going to make the banana muffins today, but that's another story because the bananas were too ripe. So we'll have to get some more bananas, leave them for a couple of days. Did we find another week. word for ripe? I think yeah. it was a mouldy, wasn't it? Mouldy, maybe. <laughs> Left them too long before I used them. So they've gone the journey to the compost and uh, I'll get some more bananas. Then we'll use them. But Amy keeps eating the bananas when we get them so they don't stand. Wow, well, what a little monkey. I know, I know. The Great British Bake Off for the orangutans. That's what the banana muffins are for. There we go. You were 
you're supposed to fold that in. I did fold it the first time. You're supposed to always fold all of your flour in. I haven't put it in yet. <laughs> you have to wait for the flour in the. In You've the, just uh, beaten the life out of it. Well, I did. I put it in before. Yeah, but every time you put flour in, you That's fold the it. That's the second flour I've put in. Ever. Yes. Don't beat it. Fold it. You see, you're knocking me concentration. Doesn't take much. You're making me do it wrong. That'll be right. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, let's have this folded in. Rich gentlemen have it, boys. Indigestion. Food glorious. Could, should we make a song up about apple Eve's pudding? We could do the William Tell Overture. Ding, 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 ding. He had a apple, apple, a apple, an apple. And he said, oh. <laughs> Was that? <laughs> <laughs> Was that the ghost? <laughs> Oops, that frightened me. I think that's Rosemary telling you something. <laughs> She's sending a psychic message. She can message. hear you, Rosemary. <laughs> saying, what on earth are you doing, girl? <laughs> Here's the apples. Um, can I have a spoon? Just Please. tip it in. Oh, tip it in. I'll just use that knife, can I? Oh, it's gone. What sort of apples are they? Um, they're our apples. Yeah. Off our apple tree. <laughs> um, we haven't named them, have yes, we? Yes, they're green sleeves. Green apple. sleeves apples. Green That's sleeves. what they are. Right, okay. Let's just give that a little shake. Right, can you just shake that mixture onto it now? Because I need the oven. Right, alright. So, if you could just so hurry just along now, please. That hurry along, hurry marvelous. along. Now you need your spoon. I've got it. Um, now I'm just moving this across to make it nice and even. I have been informed that you don't move it. How? You, you don't press skim it, down. it. You, you don't press it skim, down. it. skim it over like that. I should have Gently. had the spatula. And here we have the finished product, Ellen's Pudding. It's been in the oven um, 25 minutes and it's too hot to touch yet. So we are looking forward to having this after our meal.